breaking news. A car bursting into flames while crashing into a strip mall. We want to get right out to local 10's Hatzel Vela. He's live at that scene. We're in Coral Springs. Hatzel, what happened there? Christy, Janice, let me show you what happened. That car has been uh, towed away, but you can see the soot from the fire. And business owners here, the folks who work here say, had it not been for this planter here, they believe that car would have gone straight right into the business. Let's go ahead and show you some surveillance video captured by a nearby business. You can see the car with smoke seeping out from underneath as well as flames. The driver tells me, 21-year-old Alexandra, says she lost control of the car. Her brakes were not working and this is the only way she could come into a stop. Let's also show you cell phone video. The cell phone video captured by witnesses and they tell us the car was up in flames and everybody from these stores that you see at this mall were uh, had to be evacuated. And let's take you up to Sky 10 because there you can be get a better perspective of what we are talking about, the exact location, Pine Ridge Square at University Drive in Wiles Road. The businesses here, Pizza Carousel, Mariachi, Spanish and Mexican Restaurant. These are businesses that have been here for quite some time, so folks who live here know them very well. The driver again says she lost control of her brakes and had to stop. The only way she could stop by was by driving into the mall. Here is the rest of the story of how it all went down. I was at the lights and I was trying to turn left, but uh, the brakes would have stopped, so I kept going straight forward through the green light. And then I saw this plaza, the brakes still weren't working, so I veered and like went all the way in here. And then I just the car kept on going and I jumped out. She called me hysterical, you know, and uh, just to receive a call from your daughter, uh, just crying and confused and uh, yeah, so thank God she's okay. You can imagine how concerned that dad was when he received that phone call from his daughter. Thankfully, she is just fine. She was able to walk away. You just saw her in the video. Now they're going to try to figure out what exactly happened to the car. We're going to have more interviews with her and her dad coming up at four. But for now, live from Coral Springs, I'm Hatsovella, Local 10 News.